it's me again, Mrs. Beltran. Just wanted to let you know, Earth Day is coming up April 22nd. That is when we take care of the Earth. We make sure to be mindful of what we're doing to take care of the Earth. Let's try in the next few days to recycle. That means using things again. In our class, we recycle our paper in our tracers and we use little pieces of paper. We make awesome things. Maybe that's what you can do. Get some extra paper and recycle. This time, we're gonna talk about water, why we should conserve water. Just to let you know, two easy things you can do every day. One of them is while you're brushing your teeth, wet your toothbrush, put a little toothpaste, turn off the water, brush your teeth, rinse, brush your teeth, and then you could save about eight gallons a year. Next one is washing our hands. We know how important washing your hands are, especially in these times. But some people turn on the water, put their hands under, soap up while the water is running and running and running, and that is wasteful. So what you do is wet your hands, squirt a little bit of soap. Before you sing your ABCs, turn off the water, sing your ABCs, wash your hands behind, in between your fingers, get your nails. When you are done with the ABCs, turn your water back on, rinse, 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 dry off in a clean towel, and you've saved water. Just wanting to let you know we're celebrating Earth Day this week. Now, Earth Day, we've talked about different types of things that we can help the Earth, but going green, what does that mean? Hmm. Does it mean becoming the Hulk? Hmm. Does it mean becoming a frog? Well, we know if we become chameleons, what happens then? Being green means doing whatever we can to protect the Earth's precious resources. One bus can carry up to 40 cars. One third of the water that's used in homes is flushed down the toilet. So if we can try not to flush too much, if we recycle newspapers, and that's all the paper that we use, we could save a lot of trees. Recycling one glass bottle saves enough energy so that one 100 light bulb could burn for four hours. That's just enough time for you to finish all of your work. So that's what going green means. <laughs>